we are filming what we're talking through for uh, the girls vanity and mirror and medicine cabinet um, so that's our mirror that Kwame just put up there so it gives you a sense of just what where it goes this outline is the mirror uh, the outer frame that's the frame that's the actual mirror and so we have two options when it comes to the wainscoting and so he's just stapled this in this is not actually it this is he's temporarily stapled these in just to give us a sense of sizing so this will be the trim on the door this would be the top panel similar to right what you see there and these would be the slats that would go down not that spacing again just an example and we talk, talked about leaving this for a gap between the two, and that way you've got the paint coming through. It's nice. It's a nice clean look. It's not flush up against like we've been looking at, which this morning we agreed feels like it's a the right approach. Um, the one thing to look at is this is the top of the vanity, countertop included. So you're looking at about six inches gap there between vanity and the top um, uh, slightly smaller than there which is probably closer to 10 inches 8 inches maybe um, the other thing Kwame talked about was he's planning on building the um, the stone backsplash so that it does not have those gaps which he was saying is you know kind of bush league and not clean right so it would go flush, these would go flush down into the stone across the back. Much cleaner look. Uh, that's where we are right now. Let me know what you think.